We made it to Lisbon, Portugal. Finally, it is starting to spit. It is supposed to rain all week, which is highly irregular. And of course I'm here for it, so that's awesome. But we made it. I'm just out walking around right now. Well, actually, I took a break because I'm tired. There's a lot of hills. Anyway, I'm walking around right now. Just kind of getting the lay of the land. I'm also like trying not to nap because of jet lag and I don't want to have really bad jet lag. Um, but let's kind of see what's out here. Let's take a walk and then enjoy. We just finished our red line tour where we got to see um, the monastery. We got to see a bunch of gardens, which is really nice. I am exhausted. I'm gonna get food and call my dad and go to bed. <laughs> up the stairs which was a hike a little bit it's about five floors um, but it's free so I get to see this view for free which is awesome look at this oh my god
We're at the St. George Castle right now. And it's absolutely gorgeous. The view is phenomenal. And there's so many people here. But fun tip is that if you buy tickets online, you don't have to wait in line, which is very cool. And then you can see how these two beautiful people just be they're such cuties. A really nice view here. <laughs> Is it worth it? Eh. <laughs> it's not worth it. I'm not going off it. Okay, so after taking four or five wrong turns, um, and a trip that was supposed to take 20 minutes took 40 minutes, we have made it to Prado. For me, to me, was gonna be a lovely idea, and I was right. I went to Prado, the restaurant, for just lunch by myself, and it was absolutely delicious. Oh my god, completely worth it. But oh, absolutely just mouth watering, delicious, so good. where I'm staying right now and I just found out my suitcase is broken I just <laughs> just look at that oh my god it's the weekend Look at these, they're so good. Mm. Yeah, that's way better. So, not gonna lie, I had methos earlier, but I had them from the convenience store beside where I'm staying, and I'm pretty sure they were made either earlier that day or previous days before. Not as good. These, these are really good. I'm somewhere on this map. I don't know if you can see it. I'm somewhere on this map. Um, I don't even know how to get to the museum. I wanted to go to the museum. So nice. 
We have to go that way? Yeah, okay. It's pouring rain. I'm walking back. And it's really nice. We had a good time. I'm walking up this hike. I'm hiking in the National Park of Sintra. <laughs> and I'm, I was like, oh, I'm gonna hike all the way up to Pena Palace. Um, <laughs> I get up 70% of the way. 60, 60, 70% of the way. Doesn't matter, it's all uphill. Like, I'm, I'm like, woo, I'm almost there. <laughs> Tell me how the gate to get through and continue the rest of the hike is locked. Woo! up to this view okay so we're waking up to the beautiful view we love it we're here for it um, I broke my luggage earlier on the in this trip <laughs> it's sliced right through that hole has gotten significantly worse every time I've switched a hotel um, or a place that I'm staying and we need to buy new luggage so I have a vacation day today because I didn't know what state I would be in after the wedding Look, turns out I'm okay. So <laughs> we're 
What I'm planning on doing is just walking to the train station and going to Lisbon. So I'm on my way to the Tile Museum, but I ended up at the St. Vincent de Vora Monastery. The monasteries in Portugal are, first off, the, <laughs> some of the most beautiful architecture I've ever seen, but also they are situated in places <sighs> where you can see everything. So we're at the Tile Museum, the National Tile Museum, and it is just incredible. I'm in love with tiles. Oh my god, so pretty. Just wow. We made it to Lisbon, the last day to Lisbon, and I got my luggage! Yes! So, me with my bread ideas again, I decided to hike to the Moorish Castle in the rain. It was supposed to stop. It hasn't stopped. <laughs> it's pouring rain and there's maybe 40 people here. Maybe. <laughs> Adventure at 9 a.m. But oh, that's where we're going. Wow. I love that. Where am I supposed to go? I don't know where I'm supposed to go. I'm lost. This place is like, it looks like a fairy tale. Like the, this, like when you read a fairy tale story and they're like, oh, you're in the forest covered in moss and an old building and blah, 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 blah. This is it. This is like, <laughs> this is what fairy tales are talking about. It's this place specifically. It really was a fairy tale, one with ups and downs. I spent the last few weeks trapped in my thoughts, exploring cities, working a lot and crying even more. After a year of questioning the meaning of life, and my life specifically, I thought getting away was what I needed. And a friend's wedding was the perfect reason. I found that I'm content with being alone, but that being alone won't heal. But I'll continue to navigate, I'll continue to work on myself, and I'll continue to surround myself with love. Thanks for watching.